How to become an entrepreneur episode 2. Thank you for watching this video and visiting the channel at values to lives. If you're new, please subscribe and click the bell button so that whenever I post the new videos, you can get an update of, right? Uh, today's episode is part three parts. One is decluttering your mind, forgetting the past, and third, bringing in change in the thinking or changing the thinking. Now, if you were to write on a pre-written page or a pre-written board or a slate, would you be able to write? Maybe yes, maybe no. If you're written on it, would you be able to read? Maybe yes, maybe no. Would you be able to read it after a while? Absolutely no. Would somebody else be able to read? Absolutely no. The same situation applies to our mind, our brain. We are kind of hardwired or wired in a particular pattern since we have been born till now. Now with that past, with that thought process, with that wiring of brain, if you want to become a new person, you want to bring in a change, is it possible? No. You got to let the past be in the past, erase and do a blank in today's present, then move forward towards the future, right? Now, how do we do it? First, stop overthinking. Please stop overthinking. Slow down your overthinking. Let your thinking pattern become a little bit steadier pace. Let your mind cool down, right? Now what happens? You will be able to prioritize your thinking. What is relevant and what is irrelevant. Those irrelevant thoughts, those irrelevant unwanted thoughts or thinking or emotions, you got to let it go, let them go, right? So that is decluttering of your mind. That leads to a second step, forgetting your past. As I said, our past will not help, I'm saying the negative side, will not help us to become a better or a new person. So you gotta let go your past, you gotta forget your past, remember the good, the positive things, because you will need them for your better today and better tomorrow. There will be, um, there will be an exercise, a change, which you'll undergo, right? During this process of slowing down or changeover, you will need something to help your brain, your thinking, your mind to get into a proper direction going forward further. I would highly recommend a small ebook or an article, I think about four or five or six pages. It's called The Seven Days Mental Diet. What is it about? It is about channelizing your thought process towards positivity and making you immune, your mind immune from negative thought processes, negativity, right? What happens during the seven days, you see, you think, you hear, you talk, you imagine only positivity. I know it may sound a little superficial, but trust me, it is practical, doable and functional. Once you get that thing into your hand and you start reading it, you might think that this is tough. This is impossible. This is ridiculous. No, my friends, it's doable. And those thoughts, that thinking itself is a proof that it's effective. Because whatever is tough and impossible, if it is done, you, you, you transform into something else, right? Now, during this journey of seven days, you got to step by step, keep yourself immune to the negativity you got to focus on positivity. It is a tough diet. It's a tough, and you, you got to do it for yourself. Nobody else can do it for yourself, right? But trust me, on the seventh day and or the eighth day, you will be a transformed person. You will feel the change within you. 
people along with you also will feel a change in you you will feel a change in people stuff you will see a change in time stuff you will see a change in physical things you're, you're thinking about the every aspect will, will start changing and that's the positive outcome of this diet now having said that once you've changed that thing the mind will start asking for more new things you you would want to learn more new things more positive things and that's a good beginning of a transformed journey right now once this is done go back and review your why's what we had talked in the episode one i'm pretty sure you will want to alter add or delete some new why's into your why right second thing write down this journey of decluttering forgetting the past changing the thought process going through this diet once you've written this you will whenever in future when you read this you you'll you'll definitely smile and you will thank yourself that you it was good that you under, under underwent this this change this journey and this will add to your strength this will add to your strength why action triggers motivation and motivation triggers further action it's a vicious cycle but a good one a positive one right which you which we all should undergo for a better tomorrow now having said that having said that you may want to have this copy either you can search in google or write to me at vipulharia1 numerical1 at yahoo.com.au and i'll be more than happy to share this copy with you second share this journey this video or this journey with your near and dear ones whom you want to be along with you not only now in future as well please 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 share this experience with people who want you want to be with them or be with you right with this i would conclude my video and as usual uh, please like this video please post comments please post your thoughts you can raise up some questions you can guide me to improve and bring out more for you and subscribe to the channel uh, just connect with me wherever you feel like for whatever you feel like uh, in terms of this growth journey right and my best wishes for you that you have uh, best days for you in your life Thank you.